Hello everybody, welcome to a brand new vlog. <laughs> so right now I am waiting for Enrique to get home. And once he gets home, we're gonna go to Fred Meyer to buy all the ingredients for our homemade DIY Pika Pika candies. Let's hope for the best. <laughs> <laughs> Victoria's new shoes. We went to the mall the other day and she picked these out. She even picked the right size. So we're like, it's meant to be. She needs to have them. So happy with them. She loves shoes. Victoria. So, so what, where are we, we going to go? Fred Meyer? Yeah. 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 Oh my god, Enrique, stop! Enrique, we can't open the windows and you're here killing us with your freaking axe. You like it when I smell good, don't you? That's my guess. It's better than smelling like garlic. He did eat raw garlic today, so he probably needs did it. you put it in my mouth? Happy birthday, Mr. Prince. What you should do is plug that white hair up your nose. Is it back? Yeah. There you go. <gasps> Damn! Came out with a friend. Oh my god, that is so white. Holy moly. That's his girlfriend. Dang. Make a wish. <laughs> oh, Enrique. <laughs> Is so Enrique told me to pick out a shirt for him, and I said, wear the lemon, and he says he's going to burn them. He's going to burn it because you guys notice how much he wears it no, in the I videos. No, I wore it twice. I wore it twice, and that's how he took it. <laughs> he's going to burn his lemon shirt. Who cares about them lemons? I'm going to put my dad shirt on. Oh. This, is, this, this is my dad gone grilling. But you need your capri pants. And your Nike shoes. No, New Balance. New Balance? See, have you seen my... Damn, that ass though. Have you seen my... When I get my BBL, I'm going to ask the doctor. I'm going to put a picture of Enrique for reference <laughs> on what I want. That's, your, that's, that's, that's only God-given. Oh, God. I cannot do that exactly. Oh, God. Okay, so for Pika Pika candies, we're going to have to go to the candy aisle, of course. Pika Pika candies or Pika Pika candies? Pika Pika. Candies that we're going to use are the ones I always see in the Pika Pika website. So Gushers. I really want to do the Gushers one. That's the one I'm most excited. Sour Patch Kids, Skittle. Oh, yeah. What? Dick. Enrique eats raw garlic. They know already, okay? No, they don't. I just said it on Instagram. Oh. What's next in the list? Okay, so we did a little extra shopping, but since we're gonna have all the candies with a bunch of citric acids, I need some Tums because, because why I'm drinking? I don't know. You're the one with the weak <laughs> stomach. You're gonna have it too. If you eat that much candy with that much lime and chili, you're gonna get. I'll have my omeprazole, okay? I am playing. Nobody knows what omeprazole is. Comment if you obviously know what omeprazole Nobody is. Nobody knows. Tommy. Everybody knows. Omeprazole oh. is like the good stuff. There it is. Nobody knows what omeprazole is. It's literally next it's to the, the freaking it's thumbs. It's the ones that's hiding. They literally hide it and have all this stuff because nobody no, cares about it. No, it's because they're giving, they're giving you like tickets or whatever it is. And it's not, so. you are out of this world. Oh. You see. <gasps> tum, 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 tum. She probably lasts you a month. You're a tum eating pregnant woman. I do, I eat a lot of tums when I'm pregnant. I'm sure she's, everybody can she relate. Are you ass? You're not 11, okay? Echo cravings. It's not me, it's the baby. Yeah, I want to try this stunt right now. Baby! Ta-da! Ahora, ahora sí de lado, mira. Ta-da! We're taking the stairs. Since we're going to eat pica picas, we're going to burn those calories. Mmm, delicious sugar. And chile. 
and chew it. Good for your stomach. Yeah. Kills all the bacteria. It does actually. The good and the bad one. We're back from the store. Let us show you what we got. So these are actually limes that we already had. You're gonna need some limes. Uh, candies of your choice. They didn't have just like a plain box of Gushers, so we thought this would be even better. It has three different kinds of candies in there. We got Gushers, foot by the foot, then we got Skittles. We didn't get the plain ones, we got wild. You can't even see your face in Dickie. You're the one who put the camera like that. I, I saw it, but I was like, I'm not gonna say anything. She likes it like that. Oh my god. You can see your face. You just look like the person from the Powerpuff Girls that oh, never is, shows the that, face. Is that better? We got Enrique here. Helping. Or somebody else. Some man, my lover. Sour Patch Kids. Then we have tahine, powdered sugar, and chamoy. So we've actually never made these, oh. but it can't be that hard, right? Oh, oh never mind. <laughs> <laughs> ah, my knee hurts And Nikki, why don't you cut some lime juice? How do you cut lime juice? So we're basically just bullshitting this. I think the beauty of these pika pikas is you can do it however you want. Free how styling. sweet you want, how limey you want, how pika pika you want it. Pika pika. Thank you, Victoria. Yeah, your dad threw that on the floor. Okay, so we got our bowl. I think what I'm gonna do first is put the chamoy in there. Worst case scenario, it sucks. I don't think so. All these things are just delicious. It, there's no way it could suck. Fun fact, Karini always said that chamoy was shit. Oh yeah, I don't, I'm not a fan of chamoy, but I think if it has all these extra things, it will be good. Okay, so I put my chamoy in there and I'm gonna add a lot of tahini just because I love that spice in there. I feel like you can never have too much, so. Enrique is doing the lime juice. Lovely. It's looking really good, Enrique. Good job. Thank you. Now we're gonna add the sugar. So sugar, I'm not gonna add too much because I just don't like sweet, sweet. Ooh! <laughs> Bruh. Recipes I saw pika pika, they, they use the powdered sugar. Oh, I know. <clears throat> for some reason. Like it must do something. No, it's just that you say you're not gonna put a lot in it. Yeah, don't. I know. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. That's why I have Enrique here. He He's the brains. You're gonna give me one. So you give that a good mix until all that sugar is dissolved because you don't want clumps of sugar in there. What did you do though? I think it needs more tahin. Tahin has sugar in it, you know? No, it doesn't. It does? Chili pepper, sea salt, citric acid. There is no sugar in here whatsoever, Enrique. The more you know. <laughs> Oh, that looks like really good sauce. If it doesn't sound like this, I don't want it. <laughs> ah! We still need lime juice in there. That's good. That's good. That's gonna. That's a ton. That's Was a ton. it really? That's a ton. Well, then just yeah. add. Oh, wait, 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 wait! I feel like it's gonna like the lime is gonna overpower everything else now. Because mm, the thing it. is, you do a little by little, and then you try it, and then if you don't, if you think you can take more, you put more. But if you that add a ton, true. how are you gonna fix it? Gosh darn it, you guys! Thanks to chemistry, they separate. And because it separates, it's easier to scoop out. Just the... Uh... Really, Indy? Is that, is that for real? Yeah. Wow, you're right. It's like nothing happened. I saw one video where they actually put it in the microwave. I don't know why. I think maybe it sticks <laughs> to the candy more. I think I think that will make the sugar in it just get um, stickier. Oh. I don't know. I, I, I'm assuming that. Let's try it this way, and then if it doesn't work, we can just, you know, go bananas. Wait, 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 wait. No, this Ooh. one. Not this one. That's actually really good. I can already imagine the flavors with the candy. Ooh. But you know what I think it needs more of? <laughs> so, I said, because I wanted to add Miguelito on there. But they didn't sell Miguelito. No. They sell this other one that was kind of weird. Ooh. Right, you guys, we got our sauce. And I think the first I one since the I'm the most excited about, we're gonna do Gushers. Gosh. Mm -hmm. ah, mm. Did you really? Uh. I just did. I actually did believe you there for a second. Nick is so clever. So you add your scoops of chile in there, and I'm actually gonna put more tahini. Oi. Oh, I love you. Okay, so we have our first ones, which is the gushers. Okay, everybody, now we're gonna make some delicious enchiladas for breakfast, okay? This salsa is made out of tomatoes, chiles, uh, it also has pipian, and uh, <laughs> some herb that they use in Mexico. I don't know. I remember my, gra my grandma saying that all the time. And here you got some delicious enchiladas. Mm. 
Mm. Look at it, he really is making enchiladas. No, make sure that all of the salsa gets on it, you know. Now we're gonna take one of these. We're gonna pull it like this. There you go. And then we have the salad kids. One, two. You don't even sound Mexican, just talk normal and you'll sell bison. Mexican when he already has a Mexican accent. <laughs> I was trying to sound Russian, not Mexican. Russian? This is how my mama used to make him. My, 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 my grandma, my abuela. This is how my abuela used to make him for breakfast every day for my grandpa. He died at 50 from a leaky gut and diabetes. There you go. I think I need some tajin on top. Some Willy Wonka enchiladas. Willy Wonka! Willy Wonka! Pica enchiladas. Ooh, pica yeah. pica sponsor us. You guys didn't think of this. No, you're gonna try it. Pica enchiladas. So do I eat it like a taco or? You can eat it however you like. I guess you can, like a taco. You can blend it and make a smoothie out of it if you want. Damn. A lot, a lot going on there. But do you like But it? good. It's give, actually really give good. Me some. <laughs> I've never had such a burst of flavors in my mouth. <laughs> I literally pulled that out of my ass, and it's actually really good. <laughs> I would sell this. Like, if Pika Pika sees this, and I see this on your website, I'm suing. And we're here trying to make the recipe. <laughs> That's really good. It is, right? Mm -hmm. It's not overpowering. Mm -hmm. Now we're gonna do the Skittles. There. Add our sauce. And of course, more tajin. I know you guys might think it's dramatic how much I'm putting, but it's really, you can barely taste the tajin. Oh no, you can. You can? My eyes. But in a good way. Oh yeah. It, it just depends to your liking. We love super spicy, flavorful things, so we're gonna add a lot. Ooh. There we go. Now we got the Skittles enchilados. You put a little more, more cancer on top. Cancer? Doesn't, isn't this like really bad for you? I think because it just really burns through your gut and gives you. Well, I did take my omeprazole earlier today. I took my Tums. Tums don't do the same. Omeprazole, oh, listen to me, listen to me. Omeprazole protects the lining of your esophagus and the whole thing, you know? Sure, homie. For real, homie. The rest of our sauce for the sandillas. 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 Shake it, shake it. Ooh, dang. Damn, that is juicy. They are pretty juicy. Mm -hmm. Ooh, beautiful! Victoria, dinner's ready! <laughs> there you go, your pica pica candy. Big candy. DIY at home. Much healthier, affordable, and overall better. Well, the gushers. There are three flavors. Gushers. You know what, with the Skittles, I think the Skittles are gonna lose the outside like coloring. Look at that. What? Nice. Oh yeah, the Skittles are losing its color. That's how intense all this acid is in there, that it's dissolving the color of the Skittles. The inside of your stomach is also losing its color. Dang. Well, I'm gonna have one anyway. Mm. I think the Skittles might be my favorite so far. Once you've had the, the enchilada, everything else is... It's not the same. <laughs> no, it's like it's like it's like heroin and then going back to Oh my god you get <laughs> But you know what? I think it needs more tahin. Oh my god. <laughs> I've said that like a million times. That's <gasps> basically all pika pika is. Like I've seen their stuff. It's coated in it, it might not be tahin, but it's some kind of powdered chili. I think Sweet. this will dry out by tomorrow and then it'll be not as liquidy. The chamoy doesn't just dry out, I don't think so. Mm. I think I think you overdid it with the chamoy and, and, and the rest. I think it was a little bit of chamoy, a little bit of uh, well, lime. And... We're just having fun. Honestly, it's really good. A lot of fun. It's actually really good. Best night ever! <laughs> Conclusion. In conclusion, that was it for our pika pika attempt. I haven't personally had pika pika before, so I don't know how the original one tastes. But this tasted really good. The recipe may not be mm -hmm. all that good. It's just the brand, you know. 
Yeah, I know. They're really good. I think the only thing that we did that maybe you guys can do different is add a little less liquid. I think that's where we went wrong. But see, I remember I had a, I had a friend who used to work in a, in a place where they sold like this type of stuff, you know, a bunch of different fruits. And some stuff is literally like this. It's, it's in a bag and it's mm -hmm. just juicy as hell and it has that's a bunch true. of stuff in it. So you yeah. eat it like that. So it's just a matter of it's just a matter of how you like it. Mm -hmm. Both Perfect. ways taste good. Taste good. If you want to have it like this with like all watery, chunky, or just have fun, do it your own way. And mm -hmm. if you like it, and you know, just trick the recipe. And honestly, man, that enchilada. The enchilada was the best. When Enrico was doing it, I was just like, oh. it, was it was really good. So I think it's a fruit roll. We didn't do yeah. roll ups here, but we have. I think plenty. it was. Probably. Anyway, I was waiting for you to say something. Oh, I was waiting. I thought you were. You said anyway. Anyways. Anyways. Anyway, it was really yummy, super fun to make. Let us know if you guys try it, and if you guys have a different way that you recommend for us to do it. Let us know so we can try it. Disclaimer: Have some omeprazole before. Yeah. Don't eat this in an empty stomach yes. if you don't want to destroy your mm -hmm. probiotics going beforehand too. I don't know. Okay, Dr. Enrique. And very importantly, one apple a day keeps, keeps Enrique, Enrique away. away.